Here we are again. TomBrooksArtist.com, my studio. Tools. Paints. Where I currently work, which is flat. Looking at this painting today. Oil on canvas, 11 by 14. Not sure what I'm going to do, so I have to relax. I'm going to rotate this. Softening my vision, feeling what the colors are, form and space. Always the landscape in some form. We have a pictorial event going on here, something over here. And the cross, the up, down, and across, horizontal, vertical. This becomes a heavier weight when that is up there. Settle on this view. It's a landscape. Uh, this is land in here. But I'm thinking this shaft right here is going to be a kind of a flame red. So I've mixed up some paint and I'm going to try it in here. Also, this is what it looks like on the palette. And as you can see, I've got a lot of other colors there from other paintings. And I pay attention to how they're interacting, like this red right here in the green. And this red against this yellow, which will probably be the sky. I'm also going to try that out. Alright, so I've laid in the red. Uh, in the upper area will be a sky. So I mean, I wanted that dark. This fits in value-wise closer to the, those mid-tones there. Now I put some of that yellow in a bigger brush because I want to kind of scumble over this and leave some of that design coming through, at least at this point. So I've laid in the, some tone up in here. Again, I haven't committed myself to how thick it's going to be. This is a little bit thicker over here. Now this, on my palette knife, is either a reconsideration of this, or it could be something here, something in this land area. Well, I've mixed up this tone here. And it's got cad red light, a little black and violet. This was the tone I showed you earlier up there. Still don't know what I'm going to do with it. This one, I believe I'm going to use on the land area. That's the wider areas, some in here. And I'm trying to decide how I want to apply the paint. I can use the scumbling brush. I can use a regular brush. I can also dilute it and do it as a very light wash. And I'm going to try that, I believe. So these are the, uh, this is the diluted pigment I showed you earlier. Use a uh, thin blade knife and turpentine. But you have to play around with how much paint, total quantity, uh, how thick, and then over here is my test. And then this is where I'm at.